Sister, do you need any help? Yes, I do. I want to do something special for the sisters, but I don't know what. <gasps> Sister, I know. Why don't we do something about the Sacred Heart? <gasps> Since we're in the Sacred yes. Heart of Jesus Convent. That's such a good idea. Yes, but why don't we remember what the Sacred Heart wants to show us? Yes, let's do it. Hello everyone! Hello! We're so glad you could join us! Today we have a very beautiful image of Jesus with us. What do you see that's special about this one? A heart! Yes! But we don't see our own hearts. <gasps> Why we can see His? Yeah, sister, you're right. It's because Jesus wants to remind us of how much He loves us. He loves us so much that He can't keep His love to Himself. And Jesus is both God and man. He's a person just like you and like me. And he has a heart just like us. Yes, but with an immense love that only God can give us. What else reminds you of the love of Jesus? I can give you a clue. We see it in churches and in a rosary. The cross. Yes, Jesus died on the cross to save us from our sins so we can be in heaven with him. Yay! That's right, and we also see light and fire. And that reminds me of being by a campfire. When I was little, I used to be very afraid of the dark. And that is why I liked the campfires, because they brought light to the darkness. And when you come close, you feel the warmth that comes from it. And it is so beautiful. It's the same with Jesus. When we're close to him, we feel the warmth of his love and we feel safe. That's right, sister. We should always remain close to Jesus. And remember that at every moment, he is with us, loving us and that He gives us everything we need, and He wants us to love Him back. Why don't we share with our friends some ways in which we can love Jesus? We can pray and talk to Him every day like a friend and ask Him to give us a heart just like His. And we can also do little things around the house, like helping out, setting the table, just like He would do. Sister, you give me a great idea. What don't we do for the sisters some mini pancakes with the Sacred Heart of Jesus. That's such a good idea, and it will remind them of the love of the Sacred Heart. Now we're ready to make our Sacred Heart of Jesus pancakes. We have everything we need. Whipped cream, mini chocolate chip, crushed pineapple, strawberries, and one orange. First, we start with the strawberries. We cut them in half, and then cut out the middle part. Then we cut off a little bit of the top to make it look like a heart. Then we peel the orange. We cut it in half and then into slices. And those slices we cut into little pieces. This is gonna be the flame. Now we're ready to prepare our mini pancakes. First we add whipped cream. Then the crushed pineapple. Then we place the strawberry in the middle and the flame above it. Finally, we add mini chocolate chips to represent the crown of thorns. Finally, we add a cross made of melted chocolate. Now that we've completed our mini pancakes, let's end in a prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Sacred Heart of Jesus, we give you thanks for this day, for the opportunity to learn more about your love, and for loving us so much, for showing us your heart. We ask you to bless our families, our friends, and all the people around us, so that they might know your love for them. We ask you to help us to be your close friends, that we always remain close to you. We ask this in your name, amen. Sacred Heart of Jesus, I, I trust, trust in, in you. you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. amen. Bye. Bye! See you next time! God bless you!